Today's been a pretty good day so far. I got the yard mowed for what I hope to be the last time of the year and it continues to bring goodness to me today with these beautiful blue skies um, with this ready to fly airplane. Now to the trained eye that's been in the hobby for a while, you may recognize this and we'll talk about that as the video goes on. But the good thing about this airplane is it literally is 100% ready to fly. Down to the charger for the battery on the airplane and uh, the batteries themselves for the radio, which also charges the battery. Today we're gonna take a look at this thing. It's nice because it comes in this cool little box which doubles as your case for the airplane. And uh, we're gonna show you that you don't need a giant, giant airspace to fly. This is a fairly small-ish field. So, as I was saying, the trained eye should be able to recognize this airplane. And that's all it takes to get this thing ready to fly. We're just gonna plug the battery in and fly it. When you buy this airplane, it comes like this. Now, they're calling this the Sky Cub, and if you like it, we'll have it linked in the description box below. And actually, today's video has two purposes, to show you this airplane and to let you guys know that where we have uh, this airplane linked, there's also some really good Black Friday sales going on. So, Abby has got a little bit more work to do in tonight's video for this Black Friday sale. Uh, I don't think this is on sale, but there are tons of other RCs. So we'll link like the RC sale, and we'll also pick out maybe our favorite ground vehicle, maybe one of our favorite drones, a favorite airplane, and have those in the description box below. So if you guys are looking for some cool stuff, there are some sales going on, and if you were to buy it now, you'll probably get it in time for Christmas. What does this look like? This is a three channel little airplane that comes out of the box that we can just throw and fly it. It's the, uh, Champ. Champ. I almost call it the Cub. It's the Champ. Uh, it's just a white Champ. Um, now the Champ has been sold out. I think it's like discontinued on Horizon's website. I think it is a discontinued airplane, but it does say sold out. And it so just I think, has been out of stock for a long yeah, time. Yeah, a really long time. I think they've sold the rights to other companies and this one is, uh, is one of those companies. The downside is it is actually a little bit more expensive than what the Champ was. The good thing is, it's different. So if you like the Champ, you've got a white version of it. And um, I don't know, inflation or something, I guess. Corona, who knows? Let's fly this and see how it does. Nate likes flying here because he gets to launch it, launch it down. down. And because we're on, we're up on a little hill right here. So it's pretty cool. Okay, let's fix the camera settings. Okay, this isn't good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll get it, we'll get it, we'll get it. Look at it. It just doesn't have a lot of control. Very wide turns, actually. Very wide turns. But that's okay. It just took a minute to get used to. And actually, okay, I know why it costs more. I know why it costs more. I think it has some flight stabilization. It called it a 3D plane, the too. The Champ just saying not have flight stabilization. I think this one does. But this kind of has a mind of its own. So here's one thing I really don't like. Let me show you. See how I have the radio right now? Watch the throttle. Oh, it's uh, like altitude hold? It's spring loaded. It's not altitude hold. It's just throttle stuck in the You middle. know why that is? Because you can switch from mode one this control to mode two. I don't two. have any control over this. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's the second down. time you've hit that pine tree. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me show you. So there's a mode one and mode two switch on here. And this radio is set up for mode one. What that means is, this would be your throttle over here, and this is how you would steer it over here. There, see, that one, that side's not spring-loaded, so it makes more sense to be throttle, right? Yeah. Uh, but when you switch it, the spring, a lot of times you switch these mode one to mode two. And the spring kind of switches with it, yeah? Yeah, it doesn't do it on this one. So then your throttle, you still can, that's still proportional, variable, but. Can I try to fly this one? Yeah. I didn't put makeup on today, but I can Hold fly throttle it. down, hold it down. Hold on, you just pass it to me and then I'll get it. Get over here. Oh wow, that's yep. right. Yep, yep, it's, it, it doesn't, right. right, yeah, I know. Why do you think I was doing so many circles? It won't go right. Oh my God. Yeah. Like, I can't even get it to straighten out. Right, I know. That's why I think it has some type of flight Here we stabilization. Go. Come on, right hand turn. Yeah, right hand turn. Stop. 
Wow. We got it. We got yeah. it in the right yeah. turns. It'll probably never go left now. Mm -hmm. There's up. something not right about this, but I'll no, tell you. No, 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 no. Mm. <laughs> oh my gosh. If, I don't know what to do. Just I land it, land it, land it, land it. <laughs> that tree. Oh, you cleared it. That was so awesome. I don't think we're in focus. Go. Oh my gosh, it's there. gonna hit us! Whoa! Oh. This thing's hard to control. So yeah, you may have decided by now not oh to buy- Uh oh, uh oh. I don't know what to do with this Try to thing. bring it back, try to bring it back. It's only going left! I know, it just, it doesn't have good controls. <laughs> I don't know what to do with this. Oh, there's a fence down there. This is very interesting. Abby is actually flying- Wait, I forgot to get mm. the elevator! Exactly. She switched it to mode one. So we're gonna see how this goes. Mad respect to everyone out there that flies mode one. No, it's hard to no. hard to steer it still. Let me give it. Let me try mode one really fast. He said once it starts banking left or right, it's really hard to get it to stop that spiral and go another direction. He's gonna try to trim some. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can't stand mode one, people. <laughs> so, throttle's still on the left, but steering is on the right. Rudder's still on the right. Well, maybe that was my problem. <laughs> the throttle is on the right and steering is on the right. The oh, wow. elevator's on the left. Okay. <laughs> That's why I couldn't do anything then. There goes the left hand turn of death or doom. Oh, tree. There we go. Oh, I don't like this. Uh -oh, oh, oh, uh oh, 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 sorry for the terrible camera work. Wow. This is mode one. I'm not, I'm not a fan, not a fan, <laughs> not a fan. We're gonna land it. <laughs> I don't like this plane. That's really weird because this is like an exact duplicate of the Champ. And I think that if it had a better radio set up, it would probably be perfect. I, to confirm, it's still on, okay? There is no flight stabilization. It's just really loud servos. That's why I thought that maybe it was making compensation. It's just loud servos. There's not enough movement on this little tiny rudder. You can see. I don't even see it moving. I did full right trim and now we've got a little movement. It's just not enough. Uh, yeah, this is not a great airplane. But the good news is throughout this video, we'll have these little things, they're cards, a the little exclamation mark up at the top of the corner. And um, those will be things that we hand picked, that we recommend that you buy instead of this. We don't want your time here to be wasted. Yes, this is a pass. So in other words, if you had your eye on this and you watched our video, congratulations, you just saved money. If you're here for entertainment purposes, hopefully you got a kick out of that. The stupid tree <laughs> is, tree. it's two for two now and we're <laughs> 0 for two on that tree. I thought I was gonna get it stuck in the top. <laughs> and um, if you're shopping, then those carded videos will be other things that we recommend in this price point that are significantly better than this. We'll also link some of the good stuff in the, wow, that's a big bird. Massive. Uh, in the description box below. So on top of that, this is probably one of the best description boxes ever to check out because there are gonna be a lot of things down there on sale or at the very least a good sale from a website that we like to shop on. Uh, we usually, it's hit and miss though, you know? Um, if you find something you like, look for our review on it because it'll let you know if it's worth your hard earned money or not. But if we personally link something down there, an actual product, then it's something that we like and give the green light for. Uh, besides this, this will still be linked there, but I would I would seriously only pay like 60 bucks for this and it's gonna need some, some rudder work. It just doesn't have enough rudder control. That's disappointing, it really is. But that's okay because you guys have a lot of good stuff to look forward to down in the description box below. Even though this didn't fly very well, it kind of gave me an idea that we can fly small planes here for you with no problem. So that that's a good thing. And just getting out here at this beautiful day, getting to fly and even with all the craziness in the world, I still have good in my life. And for all that good, I thank God. I also say a huge thank you to all of our Patreon supporters because of you guys, we can keep our videos 100% honest. And yeah, when we have a dud like this, we don't need to sugarcoat it. We don't need to say, oh, it's good, maybe buy it. No, 
this is a pass. We're giving you other recommendations, and because of the Patreon support, we can just keep those videos, all of them, honest. So thank you guys. Everyone says thank you to our Patreon supporters too, because now everybody knows this is a uh, this is a solid pass. Did you get any good deals on Black Friday? If you did, let us know about them in the comments section below. And while you're at it, check out the sales that we have listed down there too. Thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you in whatever video we have popping up right about now. It'll be a good one. Bye.